Hotep Libra. Okay, baby. It looks like you're dealing with somebody here who is in a lot of pain, okay? This person is in a lot of pain because they have something that they need to tell you, okay? They have something, a confession that is deep down in their heart and their soul that they want you to know, okay? It's like this person, uh, when they imagine you, they see you with all of your clothes off. I mean, you don't have on one stitch of clothes when this person imagined you and remember what it was like when you two had all types of booty, butt, naked, freaky, hot uh, sex with each other. Now, it's very difficult for this person with the uh, sacred destiny cards. It's very difficult for this person to even focus on anything else whenever they think about you, Libra. Only thing they can see in their mind is your naked body here. They can't work well. They can't study well. There are things that they just have to do in their life that they're having a hard time doing because you are the absolute object of their affection. Now, this person uh, is about to go ahead and take the leap as the fool right here, okay? They're about to go ahead and take the leap uh, towards you because they also remember when you wore this daggone bra and panty set with a little thong up the booty and your hair was very long and you was very sexy, okay? They remember that too, Libra. They're about to jump off the cliff. You know what I'm saying? Because they are not afraid to tell you how they feel. They're not afraid to, uh, you know, uh, tell you what is deep inside their heart and their soul and what they want from you. And out of this whole uh, situation that you've got going on here, they're going to tell you or they're going to be delighted to tell you how they feel. They're going to tell you how delighted they are that they met you, how delighted it was for y'all to have all types of sexual uh, intercourse with each other. Okay. Sorry, the birds are out there. They just came real close to my window. <laughs> Here's the uh, the will of destiny here. Um, Libra. <laughs> okay, as you can see, this is a position of 69. Where somebody got you on top of them with their hands on your butt cheeks, opening them up wide so they can... To stick their tongue all up in between your legs and you are giving them uh, oral sex too and vice versa you know you got this person on top of you Libra you got their butt cheeks open and your tongue all up in it you know what I'm saying and they are they are giving you oral sex too it's been um, enlightened because it's the divine will of destiny it is enlightened to you that it is your time or well, not you, your person, sorry. It has been enlightened to your person that it is time to come towards you. That it is time to have this hot, passionate, love-making session where y'all are giving each other all types of oral sex and y'all are doing all types of freaky things to each other. This person either wants to do this to you because y'all haven't done it yet or that's all they're thinking about is when y'all did it. Now, who is we talking about here? Libra, you're dealing with a Taurus, the god goddess of love. You know what I'm saying? This person was real fixated on having sex with you. It was like they couldn't get enough of your daggone body. And if they haven't had sex with you yet, they want to. They are thinking about it. They are only focused on that day when they can. Here is the Capricorn right here. Uh, Cardinal is I don't know what. This person wants to do all types of freaky physical things to you. Okay, here's the Gemini. Gemini went hot and cold. They're about to confess to you that the reason why they went cold is because when they were hot, they damn near burned themselves thinking about you or when they were uh, doing the deck on 69 and you uh, went ahead and uh, climaxed. That, that's that, that right there kind of burned their throat, baby, or burned their tongue, their lips and everything. Here's the Pisces right here. Somebody very spiritual, you know what I'm saying, very much off to themselves, but they want you to come back to them. You know what I'm saying? Here is the Sagittarius. Sagittarius sitting up here about to sh shoot that arrow at you, uh, Libra. So you're going to have to be careful about this on Sagittarius because they are very passionate. This arrow represents... Um, the wand that they're trying to shoot at you. It also represents the, uh, 
whenever they ejaculate inside of you how hot like I said it is anyway let me go ahead and get the uh, deck right here these uh, tarot cards that I'm using are from the erotic fantasy tarot Libra but I'm going to be clarifying them with the Casanova tarot okay I'm get you three shuffles baby Libra, this is your Lover's Den reading for the month of June 2021. It's for your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Lilith, Signs, Love. And I am the Cosmic Divine Tarot. And if my voice seems a little bit hoarse, it's because I am still congested. I'm still trying to get the... Uh, get better okay so drinking my tea and whatnot my voice didn't completely leave me during this time but you know it is still like trying to <laughs> anyway let's get some confirmation on this uh or clarification on this uh page of chalices okay what we got oh heart broken i'm thinking that you two separated libra you two separated or this person is at a distance from you and they're heartbroken it's like the three of swords like they're probably in hotels or something like they're probably traveling or something it's like or they're back at their house and what their house look like is a slum or at least it's looking like that right now because the person is heartbroken. They may live in a condo. <laughs> they may live in a condo, but everything around them looks like a slum because they're crying and they're hurt because they need to tell you how they feel, Libra. Let me see. Here we got the, the Queen of Pentacles here. Because what they want from you is like a marriage this is somebody who is the minor arcana of the uh the empress okay this person sees you as a wife or a husband okay like i said they see you with all your clothes off here baby and when they imagine all of your clothes off here the only thing they can think about is pulling your panties down to your ankles and that pentacle right there is their face in between your legs okay and this person just wants to tell you how much they want to taste you how much they miss tasting you how much they miss having sex with you how much they want you back you're the most opulent beautiful person that they have ever seen in their life and when they had sex with you it was just the ultimate let's clarify this um fool right here clarification on the fool come on come on y'all here we go okay nine of pentacles looks like libra you may have somebody else though this person wants to come towards you there may be somebody who is desiring to have sex with you wanting you like all over your breast right here Libra. you know what i'm saying all over your breast they're desiring to come into your bed where you have somebody else who is comfortable in a relationship with you back here asleep and whatnot this person is thinking about coming to your bed taking the leap and removing you from this other person that you're with here Libra so I'm thinking you were dealing with somebody who you may have a one night stand with or you may have been flirting with and y'all may have been talking a lot feeling each other's energy having tantric sex and whatnot and this person just needs to uh you know what I'm saying come towards you having some type of real sex baby here is the moon card right here that's a secret Libra that's a secret this person is trying to take you from your person they're trying to be uh like I said they don't have no fear no doubt that you belong to them they're going to move in darkness you're not going to see them coming okay they're going to try to take you from your person if you're dealing with somebody or if you were dealing with somebody in the past and they're still in your mind and your soul and in your heart this person is going to try to remove them from that or from you in secret okay i think they're going to try to use this sex right here to do it let's go ahead to divine will was a divine will of destiny gotta say okay here is the knight of pentacles baby Okay, yeah, it is time to move. This person is moving slowly, though, or they have been moving slowly, though, until it is time for the wheel to turn. It looks like this person is not really making any moves towards you until it turns. 
okay? They are cradling this pentacle in their hand because this pentacle is like this uh, this chalice also that they have in their hand, baby. We got uh, five of pentacles, all right? So this person feels, like I said, hurt, real hurt, left out in the cold. They want to come towards you and move slowly, like I said, in the darkness so that they can ensure that they take you away from this other person who you're dealing with. Or if they're trying to remove them from your heart and soul, they're doing it in a slow, mythological way, okay? And you don't even know that they're using the sex and telling you how much they feel or how much they love you to remove this other person from you or from your heart or from your soul, Libra. And let's go ahead and get into these um, love oracle cards here, okay? First card we got is leaving space. This person prays that you are leaving space for them like they're leaving space for you. They're clearing a drawer out for you. They're saying give yourself time to heal. That's why they're not moving that fast towards you. The right one can't come if the wrong one is there. So they're trying to remove the wrong one that you're dealing with. Feel great first. Feel the feeling of having a partner, healthy relationship. Raise your vibration will attract the same. This person is trying to raise their vibration. We got relational abuse, Libra. <coughs> Excuse me, wait a second. Okay. Relational abuse. Is that what you're dealing with with this third party? Somebody who has red flags that are... Uh, Emotional, physical, sexual, and financial in nature. You asking for help in a situation, Libra? Or is it this person that's dealing with somebody else trying to sneak away from somebody else to come to you? It could be both ways, baby, but we got a narcissist on the scene here. So one of these people in this bed, one of these people are narcissists, okay? Manipulator. They're manipulating you. They have relational abuse. You're dealing with somebody who has... Relational abuse, there's all types of red flags, they're egocentric, entitled, selfish, rule breaker, they're disregarding your boundaries, this narcissist, okay, now you got somebody who just needs one date with you, this person is trying to confess that they love you, they get, they're trying to get you to switch up your type, they want you to take a chance with them. Okay, it takes time to get to know someone. That's why they're moving so slow, because it takes time to get to know them. But they want to date you. They want to see you. They want to enjoy you. They want to have all types of sex with you, um, Libra. Okay, but it says be aware of dating patterns. Stop what, stop what doesn't work. Uh, you know, change the subconscious uh, patterns. So that's telling me that this person is dealing with your subconsciousness trying to remove this person from your past out of you you may have been dealing with somebody from the past libra and this person is trying to help you remove that type of uh you know baggage that is inside of you because they want to pour into you this chalice right here they want to pour into you this love right here they see that your heart broken and they're also heartbroken that they're not with you or that you're not open to them being with you right now like that. Because they see you as the most beautiful person that they can ever, that they or they have ever come in contact with. Okay? So that looks like what's going on here. This person trying to remove you or remove those feelings that you have for somebody else. Here is uh, the psychic tarot, baby. All right? I pulled you one card. And you got wisdom, Libra. Wisdom, okay? That's number five, by the way. Let me read it for you. It says, when the student is ready, the teacher will appear. Okay, so that just talks about when you're ready to uh, remove this person out of your heart and soul. The teacher, this person will appear. They're moving slow right now, but when you're ready, they're coming. This card illustrates that there's a spiritual teacher who's about to influence you or step into your life to impart his or her wisdom. Look around. Is there someone in your life who has uh, the acumen, education, knowledge, and 
ability to integrate spirituality and its laws into the constraints of the physical. Mm. Is that this person, the physical world? This could be a compassionate person who offers guidance and inspiration and reminds you that you that you're so much more than a physical being. You're also a spiritual being with unlimited potential. You may have also drawn this card to confirm that it's time to reach out and find an organization or group of like-minded souls. Being, being part of a group where you can be yourself, share your thoughts and get valuable feedback can infuse you and encourage you to be all that you can be. Kindred support helps you live life to your highest ideals. Finding the true inspiration and enlightenment that's part of your soul. Sorry, I need glasses, y'all. But anyway, it says, over time, the student of, often becomes the teacher. So don't be surprised when others seek out and find you. This card of wisdom is letting you know that you have so much to share, whether you realize it or not. Okay? Yeah, this is the Hierophant. This is the Hierophant card, okay? This person is trying to build something long-lasting and sustaining with you, perhaps even marriage. Like I said, this is a wife right here or a husband. This person wants to be that with you, okay? You're dealing with somebody who did not want to be that in the past or this person may still be in your life who got too comfortable with you, Libra. They're not satisfying you sexually, mentally, spiritually. You know what I'm saying? They probably holding secrets and whatnot. Probably got somebody else on the side. But now it's time for you to bring this person in. You know what I'm saying? Or this person is trying to come in to be what it is that you need them to be. Okay, Libra? All right, love. Now this has been your reading.